says the most important thing that a candidate searches for when he thinks of preparing the IELTS examination. The strategies, whether it is related to reading, listening, writing or speaking. Hello everyone, this is Yesha and I'm back with another video which is related to IELTS speaking strategies. Today, we would understand what should be the pattern of answering the questions in each part of IELTS speaking. So here I have made different sections and also explaining the level or the pattern of explaining our own answer, the exact method which should be followed when you are attending the IELTS examination, especially the speaking part. So let's take part one. Everyone knows that part one is related to familiar topics. Again, I would just repeat the familiar topics are work, study, music, sports, genes, clothes, flowers, colors, neighbors, hometown, um, country. These are some of the familiar topics in which each and every candidate can give his or her own answer. The way he thinks about these particular topics. So he has to answer according to his own experiences. The questions would be around four to five. That is the number of questions would be around four to five. What should be the pattern of answer? Here we have to answer in brief. It is better that we do not give more descriptive answers in part one as it is just the starting of the IELTS examination. We don't want the examiner um, uh, gets confused or she gets upset with a long answer in the very initial part. So we would make sure that we give brief answers. Uh, I would say that let's limit it to three to four sentences. Yes. So in short, the answers would be precise. They would be exactly the point which is asked in the question. Next, we would move to part two, which is the cue card. A topic would be given by the examiner. You will have one minute to prepare on that topic. Earlier, we have also posted a video related to how we can make the notes in one minute and how we can prepare our talk, taking all the vocabularies in use and we would finish that talk in two minutes. So you can just take a look on that video as well. So here again, I would repeat, we have one minute of the preparation time and we have to speak on that topic for one to two minutes. When we finish this, the examiner will take you to part three. Part three is discussion topic. Discussion means we would be discuss discussing the topics related to the cue card. For example, uh, describe a book that you have read. So what can be the discussion topics? The discussion topics can be writing as a profession or talking about authors. So these are the two topics or related topics can be taken in the discussion part. Again, the examiner might ask you four to five questions. She can also increase the number of questions depending if she wants to hear more of your language. Here, the main part, the strategy that is used is we would give descriptive answers followed by an example. If we give an example in part three, this would say that we are very good with the language and the assessment would go in a better manner. So descriptive answers are suggested in part three. Again, you can also give an example. Example, not in each and every answer, but yes, if the answer asks for an example, you should and you should make sure that the example is exactly related to the answer. These three parts, when you finish, the whole test gets completed around in 11 to 14 minutes. So let's say that the main strategy that is to be followed is we would consider the length of the answer. 
So part by part, we would increase the length of the answer. And in this manner, we would effectively attend the IELTS speaking examination with perfect speech, pace, intonation and also the length of the answer that is considered. So again, I would repeat part one would be brief answers. Part two already suggested time is given that is two minutes and part three would be descriptive answers. Do like, comment and share our videos. You can also subscribe our channel for more videos like these and you can also book speaking and writing sessions with us. We would be giving you more strategies related to the other modules of the IELTS segments. Thank you so much.